I really think, uh, particularly on, on the aspect of systemic change and impact that is, that is not necessarily just benefiting that one enterprise or one organization, but impact that is really uh, perhaps disrupting or impact that is improving or strengthening systems that are, that are within that particular industry. So as Shula Direct, we work in education and for us, impact is, is, is actually a result of a chain of successes. So when you introduce any, a new innovation as we did in the market, we expect of course to have attitude change that people have to, to be willing to try uh, and understand that they can learn online, they can learn on a web platform, they can learn on an application, they can learn over an SMS platform. And at that point, the success can be as simple as just that mindset and attitude change. And then of course, when you consider that impact, then we ask ourselves what happens after they've been able to understand how technology can play a role in learning. So the impact will be the outcome of that one success. But then we also look at, um, when you also consider impact and success, Another success could just be how do we have all the different uh, players in the ecosystem, all the different stakeholders in the ecosystem getting to work together. So collaboration in terms of improving systems, collaboration in bringing a solution to life. Again, um, I'll cite an example from our own experience as Shula Direct. We work in education and technology. So these are somehow very different industries. And with our solution, we rely on, on both of them. We rely on education as a sector, we rely on technology as a sector, we rely on communications as a sector. And success could be as simple as being able to have all these three sectors speaking to each other, coming together and be, be deliberate about their success as a team. So when we consider, um, when we consider success, I think success through a chain of different elements of success will eventually lead to impact. So we really believe that there is, there is, it's so important, again, focusing on user-centered or human-centered approach, it's so important um, to, understand, uh, to understand users' needs or to understand um, our, our partners' needs. And even that understanding and communicating that understanding in itself is not necessarily impact, it's just awareness, but it is success.